details are very sparse at this moment in time, but there are reports from public witnesses that the gang has made an unorthodox escape while taking a male hostage with them. The gang, and especially the leader, are labelled highly dangerous and should be avoided at all costs. Why'd you fight in you imbeciles? Didn't mean to, did I? I tripped. Well, don't trip again. Right, uh, you take your rounds. Okay, yeah. right. uh, right, let's get up. Easy with it! Oh, I'd be easy with it. Right, yeah. down. He doesn't look anything like his photo. Well, it's obviously due to be retaken, isn't it, Ted? Why don't you take one? It'll last longer. Oi! You shut your mouth, punk. Here, Ted. Go and get a camera from the green room. For the album. Right, you know. Didn't want to have to do this, pal. You just got caught up with things, that's all. But that's just me. I would love to sit here all day and listen to your poetry. But when do I get to meet the actual boss? Ah, smart guy, are we? You'll be meeting your maker. You carry on like that. Capiche? You ain't seen my key anywhere, have you? things up. You know, I can help. You'd have to untie me though. Yeah, right. If that's gonna happen. I am a smart guy, remember? I can help. Well, have fun exploding then. You try any funny business and I'll kill you. If you don't untie me now, we both die anyway. Your choice.
used to people calling me that. <laughs> Maybe they're right. I'm sorry I got you into this, pal. This wasn't supposed to happen. I screwed up. Again. I screw up everything. What was you expecting? Money? Like anyone's gonna pay a penny for my life. What are you talking about? Of course they would. Look. Look at you. For your clubs and businesses. You're living your life, pal. This isn't my wallet, you half-wit. I stole it. All right. You mean you ain't rich? Of course not. Look at me. I'm not some thriving millionaire. Just some thieving scumbag. Oh. I'm the pathetic one here. We both are. No, you're not. Yes, I am. You even said so yourself. Besides, I'm the one that got us trapped in here and blown up. By like closing the door and kicking the bomb. Oh, to rub salt in the wound. You didn't even get away with any money. Being a criminal isn't just about blowing someone up. Look, I'm an extremely selfish and ignorant person. <laughs> And look at you, you're just not. No, I am. Oh, yeah. I can't believe this. I'm developing Stockholm Syndrome with the most pea brain criminal on the planet. Well, then, let's just agree to disagree, then, shall we? Why? Right. Can I ask you a personal question? Yeah, go ahead, why not? We'll both be dead in a minute anyway. Why do you keep clutching your stomach like that? Well, that... That's nothing. That's just a vindaloo I had before the robbery. Just trying to find its way out. Oh! oh. Never mind the bomb. My belly feels like it's going to explode in a minute. Mm. Oh! I think I'm going to be sick in my knickers. Oh, no, you don't. <gasps> I'm having the stench of second-hand Vindaloo as my dying memory. Look, fine. I'll help you, but when this is over, I'm getting a safe distance from your ass. All right, fair dudes. It's Connor, by the way. Lenny. Honestly, you might kill us faster, but so could your dodgy anus, so I'm willing to try anything. <laughs> On three. One, two, three. <laughs> Boss, you in there? I got a camera. Hello, boss. Don't touch me. Get up by myself. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 
Listen here. If you ever tell anyone about this, I will find you. I won't. I won't. You don't have to do anything. Please. Just tell me how to get out of here. You tell you that. You know what? Don't bother. I'll find my own way out. You'll probably leave me in some boiler room anyway. <coughs> Thank you. Thank you for it. Yeah, whatever. Just don't blow yourself up in the future again. All right? Good luck with your job. I guess. shouldn't have had the Indian food before a job. Yeah. Where's... Did you blow up the hostage? Um, yes. Yes, I did. What? Why? We still had a few hours on the clock. I didn't like his tone. His tone? Yeah. You got cocky. A bit too cocky for my liking. Something had to be done. So you know what I did? I gave him a little taste of what happens when you poke the bear on open season. I did. Yeah. But we didn't even get the money. It ain't about money, Teddy. It's about respect. Wow. That's cold. Cold? It's ruthless. Especially for him. Ah, you think so? Well, thank you. You've no idea how long I've been waiting to hear you guys say that. You guys are the best. Now, gentlemen, if you'll excuse me, I've got to go clean up my mess. And I ain't talking about the one down there. Capiche? I'm cold. I'm cold. And I'm ruthless. Yeah. Take it back. Indian food's the best thing that ever happened to him. Where's Ted? <laughs> 